Real Kung Fu Thai. Talking about traditional Chinese Kung Fu. Is it the last days of traditional Chinese Kung Fu? Well, as long as I am here, and I think I can speak for some of my students, it won't. But now I'm just talking about a particular place. That's where we are, right? Here in Hanover, Germany. Some of my students that live not in Hanover are Sava in Panchevo, Belgrade, near Belgrade in Serbia, or Dali, a student in Hamburg, or Andreas, who's nearby Kassel, Frankfurt. But that's not enough. It's not enough to keep it alive. We also have to work on our training methods, on our basically have to open our mind and I think I feel that I pretty much have been doing that for a long time so it's not dying but we must make sure it's practical it's usable it's um, of course, it's not only all about fighting. It's about the traditions. It's about the culture. It's about improving yourself. But at the end, it's martial arts. Martial arts is for fighting. Right? So, we make sure we can fight with it. Not only know how to play forms or, you know, Lion dance, stuff like that. We need to be able to teach our students to defend themselves properly.
Doppeldeckung, Doppeldeckung, Kinn runter. Mund zu und schlag, schlag, dann Debs.